Hello YouTube! This is Fabu Online and I'm going to teach you how to get Flappy Birds for the iPhone iOS 6.1 or any jailbroken iPhone. I, yeah, iPhone, iPod, or iPad. Now, first things first, you're going to go into Cydia and just one sec I will show you how here we are we are in Cydia I am uh, in Cydia 6.1 as I said or sorry iOS 6.1 um, I'm using the evasion one okay go into your sources but first hit manage then sources you're going to hit edit which is at the top you're going to hit add and you are going to add a new source to find this um, program that we need to get Flappy Birds. Um, what I'm using is repocidia.com. Once you have that installed, you are going to let it load up. Click on it. And you're going to want to find the um, app sync program for your iOS. They have iOS 5.0 plus, iOS 6, and iOS 7.0 plus. You're going to want to pick the one that you need. I need six iOS 6 because I'm running on iOS 6.1 once you have that you're going to want to go back into it after you have that installed and you're going to want to find what is it called v v share so if you're lazy just type in Hold on here. Oops. Yes. V share. And you're going to want to click the one that came from that source, which is right here. 1.0.57.1 dash FIX. And it is made by Repositia or was stolen. Click it, install it, should just work fine. Um, that way you should be out, all ready to go. Now, mine is right here. Wait for this stupid camera to... Uh, whatever. I'll just this is what it will look like and this is how it will load up upgrade the first time and then afterwards you can just hit later um, the the reason you want to do it the first time is it will add an open IPA function IPA is basically like an ISO for apps um, but here it is right here um, in the featured Flappy Bird shit I don't want Ice Run I want, fuck. I want that you're going to click this button here install it's going to ask you for what the latest version is it's I think it's 1.2 is the latest version of Flappy Bird. It will start downloading right here in the download part. And it should just be right there. And then it should install and once it's installed it, it will tell you that it's installed. And you might have to restart your iPhone or iPad or iPod or whatever 
but I think it should be all right. And then you go to the back where I had it. And here we go. I turned the volume off. I've been playing this for a while. I'm terrible at this, so anyways. But that's how you do it. Um, there might be an issue with the download part. Um, it, it's kind of complicated to uh, explain, but basically uh, when I was originally trying this with a different source, um, when I went into vShare, which is the software you're going to need. This is called vShare, by the way. Um, uh, when I went to go download, uh, what is it? Flappy Bird. Um, it said it didn't have a download folder to download the IPA, which is the file you need to install it. Um, and what I had to do <clears throat> was I had to get an app called iFile. And I went into iFile and you go into uh, slash var mobile documents and oh wait, not documents, sorry, library and you're going to want to find you're going to want to hit edit sorry edit in the top there you're going to want to add a file and type in downloads capital d o w n l o a d s downloads right you're going to want to put that file in there in the directory click on it and uh, you'll see here this is where i have a file I was working on and that's where it will default download to for your uh, for the vshare um, what I did to solve it was when you click on it it will ask you to open in vshare right and what you would do is you click vshare and then you're going to hit your home button and it would go to vshare and then you should be able to see it in the downloaded section. Um, th that's it. I think uh, if you have any questions, YouTube, uh, let me know. Um, be happy to answer. This has been another Fabu Online production. Thank you very much. Like, comment, subscribe. Bye.